How to borrow money from Binance. Hello guys, welcome into this new video. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can borrow a few cryptos on Binance using this awesome feature called Crypto Loans. So, as you can see already into my Binance account, the first thing you want to do is to enter a login into your assets, into your account. And after that, you want to select the option that says Finance. Now in here, you want to find these three options and we want to select the second one that says Crypto Loans. Okay, so now that we are in here, we want to select the option that says I want to borrow. And where it says I want to borrow, you want to select the token that you want to borrow. So the great feature about this uh, part of the borrow for a spot is we can select a lot of cryptos down in here. So let's try to fill. So if I want to borrow, let's say Dogecoin, I just select this one and let's say I want to borrow 9,000 here. So the collateral amount must be 5 BMV. Now in this case, I only have uh, .02 in order to make that asset. So if I go and select, let's say a little bit less than that, let's try with USDT. So it says that the minimum amount of the borrow is had to be $100. And in this case, I need a little bit more for that. Now in the long term, how many times is going to be charged to us? So there's no interest penalty for early repayment. In this case, I'm going to select 14 days if you want to. And if I select, let's say, 30 days, you're going to be seeing that the collateral amount has been the maximum. Amount, the maximum amount has been reached more than that. If I select 90 days, the liquidation price has been changed, and that's the reason why the hourly and daily interest rates is going to be changing every single time so after we borrow this money we have to pay also this interest amount so at the end of this day so at the end of the day we have to pay all of this the repayment amount so if we borrow let's say 50 dollars of usdt in the end we have to repay 51 dollars after 90 days which is actually pretty weird so and after you have your money and after you have all your collateral amount in order to make the transaction you have to go and select the option that says start borrowing now you can use this money to spot to margin to future trading or you can even stake to earn high apy and the best part is that you can repay this at any time and after you make the payment the collateral that you just paid you can be receiving it into your spot account so after you make the borrow you can go into your wallet and go into fiat and spot now if you have any more questions about the crypto loans or you have any specific questions you can scroll down and go into the FIQ section or maybe you have a question like how is the interest calculated and you click in here and there you have the question and the answer oh the most popular question is there any risk when the collateral is used for staking Binance does not assume liability for any losses incurred due to the project on-chain contract security issues. Even if you go into the Binance section, you can select the option that says Learn and Err Courses. So Binance is going to give us free cryptos through learning. There you have it guys. Don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel if you want to see more about the Binance application. Leave your comments down below and I'll see you guys on the next one.